everyone welcome back to my channel Sidekicker. In this time I'm going to compare the notification control center comparison between the Realme UI 4.0 versus Realme UI 3.0. So what you can actually expect regarding the notification control center and what are the changes it has been done between the both UIs. So in case if you're interested in more details and features about the Realme UI 4.0, so make sure to check out the playlist of the Realme UI 4.0 in my channel. There you can actually find all the details regarding the update, what you can actually expect in the Realme UI 4.0. So first thing is that there are a couple of things which has been changed regarding the Realme UI 4.0. So where you can actually expect this is a new type of uh, control center when compared with the old type of design. As you can see friends clearly the design has been changed so this is a major upgrade for the notification control center in the realme ui because previously in the realme ui from 2.0 to 3.0 nothing has been changed not much has been changed but from 3.0 to 4.0 you can actually expect this type new type of notification control center which might be present so which looks similar kind of uh, the miui phones as well because in the miui as well you will be able to see this kind of two options on the top when you try to uh, pull down a notification control center but right now these are actually it looks like between the both uis you can definitely see the difference so when you try to pull down you can actually get the notification control center touching to the bottom close to the bottom but in the realme ui 4.0 it stops in the 60 percent of the screen that's the difference you can definitely see your friends what's going on regarding the overall uh, notification control center design so apart from that i did not see any kind of major difference but one thing is that i did observe the haptic feedback has got slightly stronger and better after the update that's also something which i need notice when i try to change between the brightness levels that's also one more thing to be noted and rest of the things nothing much new has been changed so everything looks kind of pretty similar and there's a media output option is present on the top now the media output option is not present here and you do get the multi-user interface on the top as you can clearly see as multi-user interface so you can tap on that and you can shift to the guest user guest mode or the normal mode as you can see that's for the multi-user functionality which has been enabled on the toggle itself and rest of the things are completely similar nothing has been changed regarding the overall layout as you can see so some of the things some of the things like you can actually access the wi-fi by pressing on the this arrow mark which is present in the both phones as well regarding the wi-fi settings you can tap on this arrow mark and you can actually do that between this both phone that's also present absolutely without any issues so this is a quick comparison friends between these both phones and you do get a similar kind of uh, options and if i did to edit the tiles you need to click on this three dot and then click on edit tiles in the realme ui 3.0 you can actually do that just by clicking on this edit option which is present on the top side that's it friends thank you for watching a state of more updates is a quick comparison meanwhile signing off until then stay tuned and bye